Hello everyone, welcome back to a uh, new camera perspective, honestly, look at this. But, welcome back to my part one of two, where I'm just going to show the Christmas gifts I got, plus the birthday gifts I got. I got a whole list of them on my bed over here, but first thing first, I'm going to get this thing unstuck, I got this. It, this is just gonna be like where I put my face while I'm just talking to stuff. Because usually you'd see something like this. Box over there. See something like this. Or like this. And I'm not doing that anymore. Because now you get to see more of my room. Which will encourage me to clean my room before I do some of these things. It is slightly, uh, not helping with the balance. I'm trying to fix with that. But it's essentially where I'm going to put my face cam and I get a face cam for videos. But other than that, you're just going to see this for more videos. Because, yeah. Uh, that's the first present that I got. And uh, we got plenty more. I'm just going to grab the first. Uh, technically one, but I'm just gonna say two because it goes together. I got a uh, a wireless third party Nintendo Switch wireless controller. It has a charging port up here. Is that not? It's wireless. Honestly, this is cool. This is cool. I finally have some grips. Looking, finally do stuff. And these are just so much nicer than my old one. Like the buttons are definitely gonna need like some pushing to for me to get used to them. And you know the home button being right here. And this is the uh the camera button. And over here's a T I have no idea what's for. But honestly I could see but honestly I wanted a wireless controller. Now I can now I don't have to worry about a cord being like around this. Or being like around here but in like in front. Where I can play on top of my desk or underneath my desk. Now I can do I I can do both. It's just a single. I can just do both with a single hand movement. It's great. And technically, I got grips on. I gri uh, these things have a grips that came with the thing, but I got packaged two of them. For my old one, I got these grips. Nothing. Uh, interesting there but the next one is interesting it's a gaming headset with a needs a headphone jack with a microphone like this is cool I unfortunately my phone doesn't have a headphone jack I'll have to buy Apple's uh, one where it allows you to change it from where it changed this uh, port of, on that side of your screen if you're watching this from a normal person's point of view. Otherwise, it should be on the other side if you're like a maniac. But it just takes a headphone, it takes a uh, web. It takes a cord sign from here and moves and transitions it. No, no, no. Wrong side. It transitions one that will be plugged in from this side and lets it plug into this. That's like $9. I'm not buying that. Also, I gotta get used to the, uh, the wobbly camera. It's pretty cool, honestly. The next one is something you might not uh, understand why I got it. So if you don't watch my lot my if you watch only too short, you probably understand why I use this. This is a retractable spoon with its own bag it can go into. I got you all wondering, why do you have a retractable spoon? That's like a main gift for Christmas. Because I use a spoon every single day when I make my hot chocolate in the orchestra room. And this thing's getting slanted again. Why is it slanting? I have to move the phone over even more. 
It's not slanting anymore. Maybe okay, that's just the thing. I just gotta make sure not to press the power button, which is literally like right the there if you're not if you're a maniac. Which is also pressing which is also one of the little things that makes sure the food not to move is also there. Anyway, yeah, well, this just allows me to steal my hot chocolate. Easier and efficiently. And I come with its own bag. The string. That way I can put this on my backpack. I'm not doing that in this video. Um, let me get it. Oh, nope. Yep. I don't know if it's some cold with my chair. I want to do this last, this next, this uh, last one last for a specific reason. But I got this shirt. Leave it up to the professional. I like this shirt. Because it was five dollars, it was easy cheap. And then the final one that I got for Christmas is this Pokemon pack. I'm pretty sure it's the deck. But I'm gonna hope it's a bunch of packs. Either way, I'm gonna open it on camera. <sighs> okay. What is it? Oh, is it like a style for them? Oh, it, it just comes out like that. Okay, we got a few different packs. Got four of them. We also got, uh, I'm thinking is that the rules? No, it's just a card list and building tips. I also got this little thing. I'll show all the card codes as I open them up. Here's the color if you want it. I don't know who wants this. You got this cool B barrel as the front of the card. I'm just gonna scroll through this backwards. So many grass energies. Dang. Gloria, Friends and Gala. Cynthia's Ambition, Copycat, Bruno, thing. I, I, I can't read backwards and my camera is so small. Hold on, let me just try and zoom it in so I can maybe see. Barry, okay, we got Purloins, a lot of Purloins, Lipod, and we got the grass types of, I see Burmy, Martham, and there's a lot of little cute little bee doofs. And a bee barrel. It's not hollow. I'm keeping the one that's hollow in a... I'm gonna keep this one separate from the rest of the deck. I'll add a different... I'll add like a different energy or something in there. Because I want to keep that separate from the rest of the deck. A turd twig. Grottle. Torterra. I don't have Torterra cards. Okay, that's it. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. Seventeen grass energies. Dang. Seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine. 30, 31, 32, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39. Yep, I gotta add a 30th, a 40th card. Honestly, this card is cool. Okay. Just put uh, all the cards inside of the box.
just so that way none of them get damaged. And honestly, I like to use the Pokemon card decks and build my own. Okay, now I got some of these packs. Because my camera's being held up, it's actually going to be a fun time. I'm still going to have to use scissors. Why do, I, why do I keep having to use scissors to open the, the Pokemon pack? Okay, there's the code. Oh, that's upside down. Okay, back. Three. Over there. Ooh. Nice. A, a V Star thing. I don't have one of these. Gabe's gonna like that. Because uh, he. Actually, no, he has one that's in like plastic coins. Okay. Sigilus. Ball of Fresh Water Pack set. Stormy. Sneasel, Dusko, Perloin, Shroomish, Piplup. Ooh, I see a cool card. No. <laughs> What's this one? Pot Helmet, Hot the Vest Hollow, I think. A Grand Bow V? Oh my goodness, look at this. You're going into the gear. You're going into the box, Grand Bow V? Cause I don't want you damaged either. You look cool. As well as the pot helmet. That goes in there too. I'll debate if I wanna use them in like a deck or something when the time comes. But now is not that turn. Alright, that was a pretty good uh thing. Okay, next pack we're opening is this one. Okay, there we go. The pack aren't, the pack isn't damaged. Okay, here's the code. Okay. Top three, go on back. Okay, I'm gonna, okay. I have no idea how to, Russ, Roseanne's backup. Huh? Okay. Bad tick, Dusclops, just got a Duskull, that's kind of, that's kind of a pog. Golet, Impotimp, I love that guy. Shings. Milsery. Another Perloin. Throw. I couldn't, I couldn't tell that what the black. Empoleon. Oh, apparently, I, huh? Maybe it's four cards, not three. I'm guessing it's four cards, not three. Okay. Whatever, I don't, I don't really care. This is my, what's more when I first started opening Pokemon cards. The last time I did this was like a few months ago. I honestly don't care. Okay. What's this good? Somewhere down the line, a Piplup drops from my hands, so I'm just gonna put that back in there. Okay, I'm opening up the Whimsicott uh, pack next. Okay, here's the code. Okay. Fire energy, I did this I did this correctly this time. Fire energy, Gloria. Monferno, Kale's gonna love that, because he has an inferno that he can't actually use because we don't have a Monferno. Saravia. I'm trying not to give anything away by him doing that. Trappinch, that's cool. Another a, a cool tur twig. Gibble! Oh my goodness, he's so cute. Look at him. Shimeko, don't care for that thing. 
Let the buzz. Oh my goodness. I got I got an alternate art Vaporeon. That is sick. Oh my goodness. Look at it. It's so beautiful. And then what's the last card? Tornadoes. That eh, could be worse. You are going in the in the in the pile. I'll take these cards over in my free time when I want to build a new deck. Okay, last of the packs that we got. I just dropped everything by accident. I got the one that I didn't drop was float cell and nose pass. Oh, now I gotta find. I'm just gonna pick them up and go over them because I have no idea where the rare is. Axu, Baltoy, Chimcha, Cast Form. Honestly, the Cast Form is pretty cool. I like cast form. Okay, so the rest probably in this last little bit. Alright, yep, I can already see it. We got a really, uh, reverse hollow. I, I have no idea what these. I'm not a card collector. I like the cards, they look cool. Reverse hollow, Gloria, and then Excavalier is the rares. I have no idea if they're actually good. This next Cavalier is actually kind of broken. Its ability is kind of busted. So from that, uh, Choice Belt, Rebrava, and the Psychic Energy. Honestly, I, I, I really like doing that. I'm just gonna pick up all my cards and I'm gonna go over all the rares I found. This Gloria, the alternate art Vaporeon, Throw, Napoleon, the Pot Helmet, Granbull V, and B Barrel. Honestly, that was a pretty cool pull. No, but Derek, I might say so myself. Now I, I have a deck where I use, I have an Axew, but the Axew kind of sucks. So, and okay, the Axew that I you they said it's actually the same Axew that I wanted to use, but it's in my brother Caleb's pile and he won't give it to me. Well, exactly on that, that's, that's a pretty cool pull. Okay. I think I'm gonna add the tornadoes, this tornadoes, into the into the deck with the grass energies because I honestly don't think I can tell the difference between having them him in and without him. Cause I want the cool BB arrow thing in there.
Honestly, that was a pretty good pull. Then I got this, which I don't, I don't, I don't have one of these for myself. Neither do I have a V Star, but that's pretty cool. Okay, that is pretty much all I wanted to uh, do. Uh, see you next time, guys.